What's up, guys? It's your boy Young Knees back at it again with another episode. So let's go ahead and get straight into the content. Your friends or whatever, your friends, your homies, they are not going to get you where you want to be. And if you hadn't figured that out by now, let me be the first one to tell you. Just put the seatbelt on so we can get rid of this noise right quick. I'm on my way headed out to see some wall. Actually, I'm on my way to the gym right now. My friends wanted me to hang out right now. I don't know if I'm fucking feeling it, alright? Because they hate on me like hella hard. Maybe it's because they know me. Uh, you know what they say about Jesus. Like, Jesus had to leave his hometown... Um, to become Jesus He couldn't be Jesus in his hometown And hey I get it I get it you know So your homies Like they've known you for too long So you they can't So they already feel some type of way about you And all of that But like friends you make Like even your online friends My online friends Fucking encourage me and support me More than anything I've never even met them in real life Some of them I have but um, my offline friends, they don't encourage me to do shit. Or, I mean, like, my, my friends from back in the day day or whatever. They don't really encourage me to... Except one, my first OG business partner, which and also one of my best friends. My first business with him, we ended up, you know, dissolving that business. But we're still friends to this day, and we both have our own businesses to this day. And we help each other out and go... We'll, he gets his consulting from me because I went out here and I actually paid for the information and he didn't want to do it. But I was like, listen, you're my homie and you're in the game, so I'll put you on game. This is I paid for this game, but I'm giving it to you for free because you're my homie. And if you make any money off that, you hook it up with a consulting fee. You feel me? Because this pet, this knowledge I, I'm, I'm fucking giving you, that shit was not free. I paid damn near fucking 65, 75 racks just, just to fucking just to fucking learn what I needed to learn how to fucking turn up on the internet get that internet money but that's for another story other than him because he is he's a he's an operator himself your friends my friends they ain't really about it they don't really want to see you shining and they don't they want to keep you at arm's length and they just want to see you not really doing any better than them and, you know, they might not have the same dreams and goals as you. And that makes them feel uncomfortable. And that makes them feel less powerful. And that makes them feel in less control. And they have to look within themselves. Instead of hating on you. But, um... They don't do that. Unlike my online friends. Shout out to my boy, Josh Dallas. He literally hit me up last night in the DM. I'll pull I'll put it all like post it here for y'all. Yo editor put the fucking uh, message of Josh Dallas up, up there. I'm the editor by the way. Um so Josh Dallas was like, "Yo man, it's been a long time. I remember I was on your Instagram live streams back when you were around 1000 followers. All oh, those were some good times. Shout out to uh, our other homie that like, I got networked in with Jesse, and he just sent me this long-ass message, and it felt really good to know that, like, man, that's crazy that, like, it's been this many years, and people still remember Smoke, and people are still Smoke Nation, this is an OG Smoke Nation member, like, this is a brotherhood, this is a, this is a family, this is a unit, and... The smoke, once you're Smoke Nation, you're Smoke Nation for life. So, obviously, I was, I, and I remembered him. I remember Josh Dallas. He was on every single one of my live streams. Like, OG. And I was like, Josh Dallas, yeah, I remember you. Man, I hope you're doing well. He's like, man, I'm glad to see you still got your page and everything, and everything's going. I was like, hey, man, nice to hear from you as well. I've literally never met this guy in the flesh and I've, I've never even seen what he looked like but 
I mean, we're homies. Like, we're fucking boys and we're homies. And I was like, man, just, I know it's been a minute, dog. And if you need a smoke pipe, just let me know the address and I got you. Don't even trip. So, hey, Josh Dallas, I got you on that smoke pipe. It's coming, so don't worry. Just make sure y'all sub to this channel. Um, and that's pretty much it. Your friends are cool, but they're not going to get you to where you want to be. You need a mentor. Um, and you also need to start paying up and paying for information because when you pay, you pay attention. Um, that's pretty much it. Like, if you didn't know, the, if you didn't know, if you don't know, now you know. Stay away from your friends. They're cool. If you want to hang out and, like, do degenerate shit with, I guess you can hang out with your friends. Like, but if they're not about that life, if they're not trying to make, you know, internet money, if they're not trying to figure this out, if they, like... If they got self-esteem issues, confidence issues, anxiety issues, like, just don't let that shit rub up, rub up on you. And at the end of the day, only you are going to get you to where you want to be. All right. Ain't nobody out here going to save you. There's people that can help you and coach you. And those aren't your friends. There's people that, are, that will encourage you and that may help you out with networking. And that's through masterminds and online networking. Make sure y'all subscribe to my email list so we can network a little more, you know? Other than that, I will see you guys on the next episode. Smash the likes for y'all. Go ahead and get this money. Go ahead and manifest. And I'll see y'all on the next episode. Peace.